Yo, what's up guys? This is your sailor friend, the Merchant Navy guy. And today's video is a small tutorial on how to apply for dangerous cargo endorsement or DCE online. Whether it's oil, chemical, gas, or whether it's operational level or management level, the process is quite similar. But before we dive into the topic, I want you guys to take a small moment and go down and click on that red colored subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. Also, don't forget to click on that bell icon so that you never ever miss a video from me again. Now, applying DC is a fairly simple process. First, you have to open a web browser on your phone. If you cannot access these sites that I'm about to tell you on a normal web browser, you can download the web browser called Puffin, P-U-F-F-I-N. If you are having trouble searching for that web browser, I will also put a link to that browser in the description of this video. Now, enter the following web address in it, 220.156.189.33 and press enter. Once you do that, a page will open that will look like this. And on the top left corner of the page, it will ask you for your user ID and password. Your user ID would be your endorse number and your password would also be your endorse number unless you have changed it earlier. Once you have logged in successfully, you will be redirected to something like this. And when you zoom in on the middle column, you will see an option written in blue color, DC endorsement comma GMDSS radio operator. Click on that blue option. Then you will be taken to a page that is divided into two columns. Now on the left hand side of the page, there will be another blue option that says application for DC endorsement. Click on it. Then you'll be taken to a page where your personal details are already mentioned as per your endorse. Now proceed to fill up the application details and click continue. A pop-up window will appear. Now confirm your details and press OK. Then you'll be taken to the second part of the application where you will have to fill up your address and other details for communication. After you're satisfied, click on continue and then you'll be redirected to something like this. This is the third part of the application form where you have to mention your modular courses for firefighting and tank of memorization, whatever DC you're taking. And also don't forget to mention the refresher course if you have done any. Now when you click on continue, you will be redirected to the fourth part of the application which is C service details. Carefully fill it up, then click on the button that says click to add C service details. If you want to add more C service details, then repeat the process. Otherwise, click on continue. Now a payment page will appear, which will look something like this. If you click on continue again, it will show you all the documents that you have to upload. Read it carefully and also make sure that all the details you have entered before are correct. Because after this, your application number will be generated. And once your application number is generated, you will not be able to make any changes in the form whatsoever. Once you are satisfied with the details, click on generate application number. It will show you a warning which looks something like this. But if you are confident with your details, click OK. Then it will give you your application number and other details. Now, look for a red button that says pay now and click on it. This should take you to your application status page. Your last application would be visible on the top. And once again, there will be a small pay now button which will be highlighted in blue this time. Click on it, check your details again and read the note very carefully. Then click continue and follow the procedure for paying online. After payment, it should show you a page like this, payment success. I would advise you to take a screenshot of this page and also print acknowledgement and save it in your phone somewhere. Now, for the final part, you will need to upload all the necessary documents. And to do so, you need to look on the top right corner of the screen. There is a small home button. Click on it. Then click on DC endorsement and GMDSS radio operator. Now, if you look at the left hand side, you can see pay COC and COP fees, upload documents and view status option highlighted in red. Once you click on it, you will be taken back to the application status page. But this time you can see a new upload now button on the right hand side of the screen. Click on it. It will take you to the documents page. Read all the instructions very carefully and upload all the required documents in the specified formats. Now wait for your DC to come home. 